I'm now going to carry out a perspective short circuit current. The idea of this test is to measure the maximum amount of current that could flow between live conductors in the event of a fault. The reason we need to know this is to make sure that we select the right type of protective device wherever it's installed in the, in the circuit because it needs to be able to carry the highest amount of current without damage. To carry out this test I need a prospective fault current meter. It's usually the same instrument that we would use to carry out an earth loop impedance test. We just need to put it on a different setting. To carry out the test I need to connect between the neutral, which of course is a live conductor, and then test between the neutral and an incoming line. And we can see that the value of prospective fault current here is 2,241 amps, which is 2.24 kA. I need to do the same test between all three lines. The second one is 2.25 kA, and the third one is 2.25 kAs. We can see that the value I got for each of the three readings was 2.25 kA. Because this is a three phase supply, and I've only measured between neutral and each phase, I need to double the value I got. So 2.25 times two is 4.5. 4.5 kA would be the value which I wrote down on my test certificate for prospective fault current. Thank you.